And on that humor, humorous uh, note, we have uh, another segment that is at this point called Bless Their Heart, where we talk about someone who's just kind of not quite cutting it. And uh, in this one, this isn't really a feminist thing, but it is a skeptic thing. And I just had to do it because I thought it was so hilarious when I, when I found it. So uh, today is the day that the flat earther, uh, what was his name, Mike Hughes, is going to launch himself into space with a steam-powered rocket. Awesome. Yes, Jen, you can probably speak to whether that's going to work or not. <laughs> uh, and look up there, go up there and look around and see if he can see if the Earth is actually flat or like a Frisbee or whatever, and I'm not sure how he thinks that's going to work. I just, anyhow, but uh, there's some, he says, to raise the money, Hughes was going to launch himself a mile across the Mojave Desert back in November in a steam-powered rocket with research flat Earth on the side as a fundraising stunt. Call it phase one of his one-man space program. Uh... Yeah. It's actually kind of cute. I know. <laughs> it's just, it is. Like you said, it's the bless your heart segment, it, right? It's yeah, really yeah. funny. Uh, uh, it's a good, yeah. Uh, he says, this is what happens anytime we have to deal with any kind of government agency. He's apparently dealing with lots of red tape, <laughs> if you can imagine. Uh, he, let's see. He tried to get the paper. Some mocked him for believing in a flat <laughs> earth. Some suggested he'd only adopted the philosophy to raise funds for his stunts. And a few even accused him of faking his previous rocket flight several years ago. Uh, the flat earth stuff, it makes people crazy, Hughes told the Washington Post. No matter what I do, people are going to minimize it. Aww. Yeah. I would sit on my porch with beer I just, and like totally, just watch this guy. Totally. Like if he was my neighbor, mm -hmm. I'd just be like, you, what's his name? Mike, Mike Hughes. Mike Hughes. You, you do it, Mike. Yeah, yeah you go, Mike. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's oh, see. my gosh. People are calling me uh, not a flat earther. They're calling into question that he's Aww. a true believer. Questioning his beliefs. Do I believe? Yeah, right. <laughs> do I believe the earth is shipped like a fris frisbee or flat or whatever? I do because in my months of research, it's months. Months, <laughs> I've not been able to prove otherwise. <laughs> Can you believe this? Oh, God. Well, oh, at least God. he's trying to falsify that's how you do it. Right. 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 Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. So here's, here's, here's some of his proof. Forget space. Hughes said, he's also come to doubt what lies underneath the planet's surface. We've only drilled seven oh, and a half right. miles into the earth. So he's he got said. a shovel now, right? Right, right. So all that crap we were taught in school about the mantle is all bullshit. No one knows. Uh-huh. Right? Yeah. Right? There's no such thing as volcanoes and, and volcanology right. and all that stuff. That's just bullshit. Uh, let's see. Here we go. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, when you see lava coming up from the ocean floor, it's kind of yeah. <laughs> tells you something, Yeah, plate right? ton play tectonics, that's all yeah. hogwash, too. Yeah. Oh, my God. Uh, anyway, that's a ways he, he needs <laughs> – where'd it go? He's an independent thinker. Um, yeah. Yeah, and said <laughs> if he makes it into space and sees a curved horizon, he'll accept that the Earth is round. You don't even have to go to space oh, to see a curved horizon. Uh, what if it's just curved? Yeah. <laughs> right. like, what if right. it's a curved frisbee? Right? It's it's right. a contact lens. It's like a hub yeah, cap. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, right? Concave, yes. convex, whatever that is. Yeah, he yeah. just needs to see for himself. Uh-huh. All righty. Anyway, that's a ways off. First, Hughes needs to avoid another delay the la and launch next week on private property outside Amboy with flat earth emblazoned on the side of his new rocket so as to convince people to donate. Hundreds of thousands of dollars to build the balloon and buy the space suit for phase two. Um, he's going to, so, yes. Okay. In, in this, his video, Hughes also addresses critics who accuse him of faking his most famous stunt because video of the stunt never shows him inside the thing. His cameraman had to stop filming to help him with the canopy. Now, here's a question. Does anybody know if this is tied to religious beliefs or is this just purely like a science denial thing? I've heard that there is... Because he's not talking about God at all. Right, that's true. He's There's just... stuff in the Bible that, that would seem to support that you should think it's flat if you are a wonder to own 100%. But if he's just like, I have to see it for myself, I'm like, okay, so you are you like an atheist flat earther then? Mm-hmm. It's not clear. I mean, he's certainly not quoting scriptures and things. It's, nope. it's interesting. It's just like, mm -hmm. is this a Bigfoot-style thing or is this mm -hmm. a religious... 
I mean, there probably are some religious folks in mm -hmm. it, I, I imagine. Oh, yeah. I just wonder if there are some that are just like, no, we're atheists, but this is we science. Yeah, same sort of person <laughs> who denies the, the moon yeah. landing and the sort of stuff. Aliens seeded us. It's not evolution. Right. right? Yeah. It, there's yeah. that. And Tracy, I'm sorry, you won't be able to sit on your front porch because it says right here, while he won't allow live spectators at next Saturday's launch, which is today. Yeah, heart officially broken here. <laughs> yeah. Aw. <aww>. Yeah. <laughs> and he promised to shoot down any drones. So don't send out your drone shot. Oh, okay. Right? okay. Unless you want to see a drone shot down <laughs> yeah. a guy in a, in a rocket balloon or whatever that is. He's going to be kind of busy. Is he going to have yeah. like a sniper there? Get yourself a cheap really? drone and yeah. let's make it a show. <laughs> uh, he said in the video it would be live streamed. So oh. I, I don't know if it's out there somewhere. but We need um, to tune in. I, yeah. Find yeah. out. Yeah. Yeah. We'll see what happens. I'm going to paraphrase here. Today. To paraphrase John F. Kennedy at the dawn of the moon mission's no one said this would be easy. Well, all right. It's so, good to have goals. Yeah. 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 I'm, I'm, you know, I kind of wish more people had just sort of like these, you know, if you're going to believe stuff, why not just believe wacky stuff that impacts you, right? It's yeah. Just like, oh, my God. There you go. Oh. Well, At least he's not out there passing legislation, right? Right. Oh, my gosh. Exactly.